on the left hand side we have three cos terms in multiplication we we'll leave the second term that is cos 4 pi by 9 as it is and work on the first and the third term we will apply here cos a cos b multiplication formula applying this formula and then further simplification of the sum and difference we get half of cos 4 pi by 9 multiplied by cos 10 pi by 9 plus cos minus 6 pi by 9 now 10 pi by 9 we can further simplify it using pi plus pi by 9 we know that pi plus pi by 9 lies in the third quarter and hence its value will be equal to minus cos pi by 9 and cos minus 2 pi by 3 also lies in third quarter and it can be simplified to minus half now we can remove the bracket and do the multiplication giving us two terms here again the first term is of the format of cos a multiplied by cos b so we can again apply the same formula and then we can simplify it to get cos 5 pi by 9 and cos 3 pi by 9 now cos 5 pi by 9 can be further simplified like we did earlier using cos of pi minus 4 pi by 9 and cos 3 pi by 9 can be simplified to cos pi by 3 cos pi minus 4 pi by 9 lies in the second quarter hence its value will be minus cos of 4 pi by 9 cos pi by 3 lies in the first quarter and it can be replaced by half we can now multiply the terms by minus 1 by 4 and cancel out the common terms giving us the result as minus 1 by 8 which is equal to RHS